Butler High sophomore Danielle Nisley was diagnosed with a rare neurological disorder called isolated pachygyria before the age of two. The disorder slowed down her brain's development, making verbal communication impossible. But now at the age of 16, she has a way to communicate with her parents and teachers and anyone else, her iPad. And she pushes the button and she's able to tell the waitress what she wants. So it's allowing her to make choices, uh, it's allowing her to speak, and it's allowing for her to get a little bit better with her social skills. Well, her teachers would normally have to send notes home describing what Daniel did at school that day, but now that Daniel has her iPad, she can pretty much tell them herself. It's made learning even more meaningful because she's seeing what all she's doing and she's able to tell them at home and she's able to tell us here at school. Just giving us a broader perspective in what she's able to do and what she's capable of doing. Um, you know, there's a lot more in there than that sometimes we know. And Danielle's new learning moments leave lasting memories for her mom and teacher. One of the things that we did was watched a video of her and she was making pudding. One day she made pudding and she spilled the milk. Danielle kept saying, uh-oh. We looked around, there was nothing going on in our house. That was the reason for her to say, uh-oh. And as they were watching the video, they realized she'd spilled milk. And for them, that was such a um, memorable moment for them because she doesn't really communicate about her day, so she was able to tell them something she had done at school. It was a, a wonderful moment. It was like the first time you hear a child speak or something, and we this is allowing us really to hear her talk. In Vandalia, Wale Aliou, Dayton's News Source.